Hello everybody, this is Bradley from Formula Talks and today we have some F1 breaking news slash rumours and these are big rumours and it's all been labelled hashtag Tedgate, hashtag where's Ted, hashtag justice for Ted and we basically, if you couldn't see where this is going, have potentially lost the glorious man himself, Ted Kravitz, from the Sky Sports F1 coverage. And now this is an absolutely massive shame. It's completely unconfirmed at the moment. But everywhere on Twitter is the complete work theory at the moment that we have lost Ted Kravitz, which is going to be a massive shame for Sky F1's coverage of this season. And he was a, he's an integral part of the sport now and of Sky's actual broadcasting team. Um, he's been there for years, upon years now. And uh, it's a massive shame to have lost him. There's absolutely nothing confirmed yet. But he hasn't appeared in any of the promotional work for the new season. The lovely um, Hollywood-style done-up advert for the F119 season for Sky. Uh, I'll leave a link in the description if you haven't watched it. I'd highly recommend it. It is very, very good. But effectively, we've lost Ted. No more Ted's Notebook. And for week two of testing for UK viewers on Sky... There is no Ted's Notebook either, which is something we have been seeing, or there's no after review, but there's no coverage for Test 2 presently. And, I mean, most of the team has been out for Test 1, so they're having the week off, and that kind of makes you think there's not left of the team, because Martin wasn't turning up anyway, Martin Brundle. But we've potentially lost Ted, because he's not, he's, where is Ted? So they've spread the abs taste by tweeting Sky Sports F1, at Sky Sports F1, on Twitter with a hashtag TedGate, and we can get justice for Ted. I mean, it's not like there's any other news going on in the in the world of Formula. Oh crap, we missed testing. Ah, well, that's not good. We should probably get on that. Oh, we missed our podcast. We've missed the last month.